What is a breakaway switch? The breakaway switch is designed to automatically slow and eventually stop your RV should it become detached while towing. Hey, I'm Matt Arndt. And I'm Bart Taylor. We're back again for another first time camper video. Today we want to discuss RV breakaway switches because all RVs come with them installed and ready to use. The breakaway switch is designed to automatically slow and eventually stop your RV should it become detached while towing. This is why you never tow an RV without a fully charged battery. The breakaway switch is powered by your 12 volt RV battery, not the seven way cord. It's very important to be sure the battery is fully charged and maintained at all times. Let's cover inspection and testing of the breakaway switch. This should be done on a regular basis. Start out by making sure the lanyard for the breakaway switch hasn't been dragging on the ground and isn't damaged. If it is, you need to replace it. Now let's test the breakaway switch. First, disconnect the seven way cord from the truck because failure to do so may cause an error message or damage to the brake controller. Hey Bart, you wanna head around there to the tires? We're gonna, yeah, pull, the, we're gonna pull the pin and listen for those brakes. First, we'll start out by pulling the lanyard pin. Bart should be able to hear the brakes audibly engage. Yeah, Matt, they're working. When you pull the plunger out, these contacts come together and that sends 12 volt power back through to your brakes. So as long as those contacts are together, those brakes are getting power. That's why it's important to put the pin back in and not uh, leave it out. If you don't have somebody back there to help you, double check by moving the truck forward slightly to be sure the RV brakes have engaged and are operating correctly. If the trailer moves forward freely, something is wrong with the brake system. Contact your authorized RV dealer for more information. If the trailer passed the test, meaning the brakes have engaged, push the pin back into the switch, then reconnect the seven-way cord back to the truck. Now let's cover some important safety warnings. Never use the breakaway switch for parking. In the past, a lot of people have done that to go in to get a bite to eat and thinking that it's securing their vehicle. It's actually just running your battery down and could possibly damage the brakes. So we'd recommend you not do that. Fasten the lanyard cable to the truck frame not on the safety chains or the tow ball. When disconnecting the RV from the truck, remove the lanyard from the truck and stow it so it does not accidentally get pulled out. As a reminder, the brake system is designed to engage the brakes and not lock them up. The truck brakes stop the truck, the trailer brakes stop the trailer. If you found this video helpful, be sure to like it and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more of the First Time Camper Series, or visit KeystoneRV.com. And thanks for watching.